So you're ready to create a Canva template for your business. And you wanna make a digital product, something unique that you've made in Canva. So when you're ready to create a digital product on Canva, you'll come over to Create Design and you're gonna pick the size of the template or product that you're going to make. So for instance, if you wanna make a printable, you might use this A4 document or you might type in letterhead for the right size because you'll see when you type in letterhead, letterhead comes up and it's an eight and a half by 11 size sheet of paper, perfect to design something on. And let's say you've created a weekly checklist you want to sell on Etsy or maybe on your shop and actually I should note that this is one of our products Inside of our Ivory Mix membership, these PLR products are there for you to customize and resell and keep 100% of the profits. But let's say you design something like this from scratch. How do you share this with someone that's purchased it from you? Well, when you're on the Canva design itself, you'll want to label that design something memorable. And so for me, you can see on my resale products, the products that I have listed, all of these are different products inside of our shop. I have general planner and I have project planning sheets. So I just label it whatever it is. So this is a weekly checklist. So you'll type that in. The title itself is important because when you share the link to this document, your end user is going to see the name of the document. So you want it to be something recognizable so that they're not confused. Then what you're going to want to do is come over to the share tab. Let me move the screen a little bit. So you're going to click on share and you're going to click on template link. Now, if you don't see template link right there, it's going to be located here under the more section. So more is all of the share options you have, which is a lot, but um, template link happens to be one that I share pretty regularly. So you're going to click on template link and this is going to be the URL that you're going to copy and and then share with your end user. And when they put that URL in their browser, it's gonna pull up a image and a link like this. It's gonna say a template created by so-and-so, whatever your name is, was shared with you. You can start designing now. And this person is going to click on use template and it's going to ask them to log in. Once the person logs into their free account or their pro account on Canva, it will redirect them directly to that template and they'll be able to access it right on their account. And what it does for them is creates a copy. So you see how this says copy of weekly checklist and it's accessible for them in their account. You'll see on my home screen, it's here on copy of weekly checklist. And from there, your end user can file it and save it to their own folders or print it or whatever they need to do with your Canva design. Now that you've learned everything you can in this video and are ready to move on to the next step and put together this free resource for you, and you can grab it right below this video.